Mm. How do you guys like your coffee? Cream and sugar or black? Me particularly, lots of cream, lots of sugar. Mm. I think we're good. Everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing short reviews on various colors of the solid color uh, polo black watch uh, polo shirt by Ralph Lauren. Uh, the ones with the crest and the big pony. Um, so these will be brief. I have royal blue, navy blue, yellow, white, and this red. Um, these are all going to be the solid colors. I've previously reviewed the black watch with the diagonal sash. Uh, so check out that video as well, too. Uh, but let's get into it. This is Men's Lifestyle with Zach Ross. Welcome back. So today I'm doing some short reviews on various colors of the solid color uh, polo black watch shirt by uh, Ralph Lauren. Uh, these have crests and big ponies on them. Um, this right here is sort of a crimson red uh, with the gold crest. Number three, this one does not have uh, what you'll normally see the same number reflected on the bicep area. So uh, there's no numbering here on the right bicep, but the detail is in there where you can see um, the polo clubs and the, the numbering and the clubs in uh, gold there, as well as a red crown. Um, <clears throat> very heavy duty stitching, black. This black actually contrasts very nice against the red and also matches the colored collar here in black. This one has a white placket and also sort of a detailed placket uh, horizontally um, underneath this vertical placket with some acrylic buttons. Um, this one also has black bordering on the sleeve areas. And so actually on the left hand side, you see the number three in Roman numerals uh, here. So this one's actually on the left. Typically you would see it um, on the right, but I actually like this Roman numeral uh, three here it gives a kind of a unique look and, and so uh, this is a very well built shirt uh, nicely constructed primarily cotton with some other materials lasts a very long time is a very good investment it gets a lot of attention particularly for the summertime um, and I just like the contrast of the colors pretty regal shirt with gold black and red uh, these are all very regal colors and you can dress it up however way you like uh, different sorts of hats baseball hats uh, fedoras, however you want to do them. Uh, I'll probably show off a few hats as well, too, with some of the other uh, colors I have here. Um, but hang on, let me show you a few more colors. So this one is the yellow with a sort of a dark navy blue uh, polo uh, on the left-hand side, big pony. Um, this one also has a dark navy collar. Collar is kind of relaxed but also you can, this one's pretty flexible. You could do quite a few things with this collar. <clears throat> it's not a rib like some of the more modern styles. This is an action, an older style, but it still has the crest, a lot of detail here. Um, this one has the number three reflected on the right bicep area. Yeah, and this one's pretty good. Actually pairing this one up with sort of a, a lighter blue uh, crested polo hat by Ralph Lauren. So it gives it sort of a nice kind of compliment uh, to the shirt. Um, so this is the yellow and hang on, I'll show you the uh, navy blue. 
So this one here is a dark navy blue black watch polo. Uh, this one has a white contrasting big pony, uh, which actually looks really good up against this color, this blue here. Uh, you can see the detail. This one has numbering on both sides, both left and right uh, bicep. This is a custom fit, meaning it's more of a slim uh, fit. Uh, and, and with higher raise, uh, kind of uh, bicep areas here on the sleeves. Uh, this one has a gold crest with no numbering. Normally you will see matching numbering of the sort. Um, this one here has a sort of a shorter collar, so it's really nice to kind of flip up without being a little bit too much or flamboyant. Um, and there's some nice detail here. You see sort of a, uh, an X uh, stitching here in white on the vertical placket. Also with some uh, acrylic buttons here. So I kind of dressed this one up with a, a black and gold Boston Red Sox hat. I have a ton of these uh, baseball caps of different teams. You know, I'm not gonna say which one I like, but I'm from Chicago. Um, uh, yeah, I like a lot of baseball teams though. Um, so this is the navy blue, and I will show you a orange as well. So this here is the orange black watch polo. Uh, this one has a nice detail here with the big pony in a dark navy blue, uh, which looks really good with the orange color. This one has numbers both on the left and right. Uh, the number three here reflected, no numbering in the crest, but very nice detail here uh, underneath the crown and sort of a uh, sun pattern here uh, in the crest. Uh, this one has a white vertical placket underneath, but if you, you know, can hide that, but it's good detail here. You can see uh, sort of a uh, cross bracing here on the vertical uh, placket. This one, you can put collar up because collar's not too big, so it uh, looks pretty cool like that. Um, this pair, this one, just some uh, black and gold trim sunglasses with sort of larger lens uh, and a black and gold Yankees cap. Uh, so this is the orange. I will show you the navy blue next. Actually, the royal blue. I'm sorry. So this here is a royal blue black watch uh, with gold crest. And this one has a little bit extra detail. It's a summer classic, polo summer classic. Got a red uh, crown here. Number three, three on the right uh, bicep here. This one also has the RLPC for Ralph Lauren polo classic as well as on the left area here too. A lot of times I like to roll up uh, one row on the sleeves, uh, ex expose the biceps a little bit more in the summertime and just kind of gives it even more of a custom fit. This is a custom fit, slim with a higher uh, sleeve here. Um, and this one has a, so the numbering is in white and the big pony here is stitched in white as well too. And there's some white, trim here on the collar and this is a ribbed collar and there's no <clears throat> uh, contrasting color here uh, on the vertical placket uh, it's just plain blue but it still looks good when you flip uh, you could flip your collar or have it down uh, you could this one has a short collar so it's still good to flip and also looks pretty cool with the uh, white trim and just kind of paired this one with a, a dodgers hat once again, I typically like to stay with the black and gold because it just wears well with anything. And uh, you could put on any kind of shades, but I think these look kind of cool with some uh, sort of black tortoise shell glasses. Uh, give it a cool look here. And so we have one more and that is just the plain white. And I'll show you that one with the fedora. And last but not least, this is a solid white black watch polo by Ralph Lauren. This one has a contrasting uh, dark navy blue big pony here, as well as dark navy blue number two on the left and right bicep area here. This one has a uh, gold crest with some red uh, kind of pattern coloring here. Uh, also the Ralph Lauren 1967 in the navy blue. Uh, this one I think looks good with pretty much any kind of look just because it's solid white You could wear it with any kind of pants um, This one I'm putting with a fedora. I think it gives it kind of a cool summer look and Any kind of shades really works with this 
So this pretty much wraps up uh, my showing of some various solid color uh, Polo Ralph Lauren black wash shirts. Uh, do me a favor, you guys, leave your comments below. Hit the notifications bell, and once again, subscribe to the channel. I'll be showing off more fashion as well as talking about some various topics on uh, men's mental health, philosophy, finance, economics, and just everyday things that uh, men are interested in, and some other you know toys that I have, and some traveling as well, too. I should be going to California soon, so I'll record that and upload my experience in uh, Southern California. So guys, this is Men's Lifestyle with Zach Ross. Uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.